Howdy cowdies, it's that time of the week, weekly walkabout. It's been busy, summer is here. I think it's been the first couple of days I haven't worn thermals. Hooray! Anyway, <laughs> I got heaps of cool shit in the auction this week. A nice little enameled coin there. Peacock, lovely little thing. Carved ivory pear pendant, nice little sterling silver cigarette case. Lovely sort of costume jewellery necklace over the back. Original Rubik's Cube made by Ideal in its little case with all the gear to go with it. Lovely old stereoscope slide of an Aboriginal encampment, Tambo River in Gippsland. Little Bakelite thermometer over the back, advertising White Cross Wire Company. What else have we got? Little Ernest Finlay etching. Nice little Ernest Warner book plate. And a little Sir Lionel Lindsay book plate. They're nice little things. Bakelite and other sort of necklaces. Nice little Beck Australian Pottery Cup. So we've got stamps, rings, cufflinks, little bits and bobs and stuff. Semaphore set of cards is pretty cool. Some nice little bits in the jewellery cabinet. Right, let's have a look at what else we got. Little Edwardian nursing chair. Nice little Art Deco sort of three-tier auto trolley. Nice round shape to it. Another nice little Deco auto trolley there. A little sort of side table, arts and crafts style. What else have we got? A little blue painted pot cupboards cute. Collection of Royal Copenhagen dishes in a frame. Nice little blouse chest. Cool little drum. Lamps, old pink plastic decor 80 stuff. Really heavy outdoor Colebrookdale style little three piece set. Boxes of stuff, cars, picture frames, mirrors. Got some cool clothes. There you go. This one's a cracker. The label, Serona Valley Ranch, where Morty Alec. There you go. Great bit. What else have we got? This is cool. It's an old, like, varsity cheerleaders sweater for a majorette. Hawaiian shirts, fox fur, summer shirts, new old stock sort of woolen vests, Hawaiian shirts, some more sort of rockabilly, pearl snap western shirts, and some ladies gear up there, nice Chris Croner's two-piece suit. What else have we got? A little concrete outdoor sleeping Mexican dudes, pretty cool. Box of DVDs, cassettes and stuff. More nice outdoor chairs and tables and umbrellas. Kids toys and footies. Group of stuff down underneath there. Another nice group, lot of mixed items. Italian ceramics, retro thermoses. Nice little sort of retro alarm clock. Big industrial meat slicer, sewing machines, grape crusher, pretty cool big waffle line in there as well. Nice old soft drink bottles in their crates, slades, all that sort of stuff. They've all got cool old labels and stuff on them. Tarax, X, there you go, it's a nice group lot. And else we've got tools and sort of blokey gear, singer sewing machines, tables, comic books, records, suitcases. Stereo gear, matchbox motorized superway stuff. This is pretty cool. The old little sort of riding slope there. Vote for Rodia on the side. He was the mayor of North Ballarat or something, wasn't he, guys? All the details underneath the lid as well. Pretty interesting old bit. You got Clyde, Papa Smurf, Madeline, and little Clyde. A box of the comics and stuff. Varga Girl Playboy book in the box lot. Group lots of stuff, scooters, sporting gear, there's a pogo stick that Aaron was trying to bloody jump around on. More stuff, bike gear, tins, phantoms, bottles, pottery, mixed items, glass, paintings, records and cassettes, popular science magazines. There's some kind of cool stuff this week. Some cool CDs, boxes of books and stereo equipment, big 16mm projector with all the gear to go with it. Pretty cool, old oscilloscope in a case, little electric fold-up bike, pretty wacky, lovely big copper pot, gumball machine, hats and saddles and retro furniture, what else have we got, Robin sign, cast iron and brassware and inkwells and sort of stereo gear and glassware again, what else have we got, records, a little group lot of mixed items there and some pottery, more pottery, cameras, Lampshades, 
Some nice pictures this week. This is nice. John Belmain. We've got a few of his works. Nice little still life there. It's a Meldrum School student. I think he was the teacher there for a little while. Nice example. What else have we got? Uh, this is a nice little Richard Chemersky of a couple of kids in the forest. Pretty typical. Another nice little John Del Belmain there of a rose. John Belmain there of the Franklin River. And this is interesting. A little French colour lithograph. Sign with the initials looks to be UM lower right. Interesting piece. 19 sort of 40s, give or take, I'd be thinking. I like this as well. A nice oriental screen there, all hand painted of a Buddha. Nice big Japanese kimono there as well. Cool little sort of 80s table. Pictures, guitars, mixed lots of furniture. Nice big Ibanez 12 string acoustic. Nice Hitachi surround sound stereo system there with the original little sort of external extra speakers. What else have we got? Cutlery, green glass, Star Trek stuff, Concorde travel bag. More riding implements and James Bond die casts and green depression glass. Deer stalker and some driving caps. Nice old bottles. Tire and mulber ashtrays. Belts. Sort of comic books and stuff, Star Wars advertising toppers, a couple of big bits of cedar, pretty cool retro lamp up the top there, another nice little 80s does deco, Australian pottery shaving mugs, china, crystal, whiskey jugs, a little lot of retro gear, what else have we got, looks like a clarinet or something in the case, David Winterhouse. Some more nice inkwells, Rubik's snakes and a booklet. Nice old black phone, crystal, Chinese, Wade, Tom and Jerry box sets, pretty cool. Toys, bottles, pottery. Stereoscope viewers, nice Bodum teapot over the back with some nice cups and saucers. David Dwyer, pottery charger over the back, or someone Dwyer. Uh, glowing uranium glass that lights up. Another nice bit of lit up uranium glass, some remude. Nice lot of retro canisters, the 50 sort of rocket lamp over the back's pretty cool. What else have we got? Nice old doll, some torpedo bottles, nice little singer. I think it's a featherweight sewing machine in the box there. Here's nice, the old enameled fireside night. Big bit of Arno Barreau. Heaps of stereoscope slides. This is a lovely sort of Victorian sewing box. All the stuff inside and another nice Victorian riding box really quite nice little Hans Heisen print over the back though but it's in a little David Heisen frame it's got all the details in the back the mandolin in the case is a pretty amazing bit I think it's going to be the what's it worth for this week as we've got nice nice Art Nouveau inkwells Art Deco candlesticks Prattware the Grange lovely old beaten copper house sign fantastic the Mexican hair renewer bottle <laughs> Amazing bit. I kind of wanted to do it for the what's it worth, but you know, the mandolin's a better thing to do. <laughs> Those little deco prints, St. John's Ambulance, enameled sign, more um, light up uranium glass, another nice little inkwell signed Australian art glass. And what have we got at the top here? Another nice art glass vase, Unit Dearborn, Melrose, Moorcroft, Bendigo over the back, another light up uranium glass piece, uh, Lucy uh, Boyd Beck. Nice little hand-painted, decorated, lidded um, cheese dish or something like that. Another uranium art glass bowl, which is quite nice. Really like the little oak inkwell with all the Art Nouveau sort of gilding on it. Anyway, guys, that'll sort of do. Hopefully you saw something you liked. You know, I don't really care if you did or if you didn't. We'll see you on Thursday night. Be a good sale.